Hey folks, this is Gazwan Kari over at SharePointQuester.com. Today we'll be exploring the task pane in the datasheet view of a list or a library. There is a cleverly hidden button which is located on the far right hand side of the datasheet view which is called the task pane. You can enable or disable that entire section and when you do so there are a number of options to choose from. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. So I'm looking at a list, just a regular custom list in here. And I'm going to select the ribbon list and then data sheet view. And then you're going to notice here on the data sheet view, here's the button I'm talking about, the task pane, enable or disabled. It's kind of hidden. You don't see it out of the box. But there's a number of actions you can perform in here, such as tracking this list in access, where you can link this list into an access database and then use it to create reports or work with its data using all the features of Microsoft Access. There's the export to Access, basically a simple way to copy all the content into an Access database table, report with Access, the content of the SharePoint list is copied to Access and then a default report is created. Uh, query list with Excel, if I click on that it's gonna give me this warning, security warning and then once I enable it I'm able to query the content in Excel in here. Uh, let's go ahead and close this. Print with Excel you don't want to print the web-based uh, kind of list. You come in here and you can print using Excel. Close this. Uh, chart this content with Excel or create Excel pivot table uh, report right through here. So I can come in here and say, okay, show me uh, the number of topics and then the hits per topic. So topic, hits per topic. Uh, so you can create pivot tables from uh, the uh, list itself in here. Again, by enabling this task pane on the right hand side. Uh, you can sort by specific fields right in here as well so it'll sort by topic. Uh, you can uh, cut, copy, paste, remove filter or sort and then review uh, help information right through here. All of these operations are hidden under the task pane so make sure you view it it can save you a lot of time when you work with lists using the datasheet view. This concludes this video. Thanks for listening in.